When a baby is conceived, it begins its development within the mother's uterus, commonly referred to as the womb. Here's a detailed overview of the process. Conception. Conception occurs when a sperm cell from the male fertilizes an egg cell from the female. This typically happens during sexual intercourse, W, where sperm are ejaculated into the female reproductive tract and travel through the cervix into the uterus, where they may encounter and fertilize the egg. The fertilized egg, now called a zygote, begins its journey toward the uterus. Implantation. After fertilization, the zygote undergoes rapid cell division as it travels down the falloperin tube towards the uterus. About 6 to 12 days after fertilization, the zygote attaches itself to the lining of the uterus in a process called implantation. Once implanted, the cells continue to divide and differentiate. Embryonic development. Following implantation, the developing organism is referred to as an embryo. During the embryonic stage, which lasts from about to eight weeks after conception, the major organs and structures of the body began to form. This period is crucial for the development of the brain, spinal cord, heart, limbs, and other vital organs. Fetal development. After the embryonic stage, the developing organism is called a fetus. From around nine weeks until birth, the focus shifts to the growth and maturation of existing structures. During this time, the fetus undergoes rapid growth and its organs continue to develop and mature. Around the end of the first trimester, around 12 weeks, most of the major organ systems are formed, and the fetus begins to resemble a tiny human prenatal care. Throughout pregnancy, it's essential for the mother to receive regular prenatal care from health care providers. Prenatal visits typically include checkups, ultrasounds, and various tests to monitor the health and development of both the mother and the baby. Proper nutrition, adequate rest, and avoiding harmful substances are also crucial for a healthy pregnancy, labor, and delivery. The culmination of pregnancy is childbirth, which typically occurs around 40 weeks after the start of the woman's last menstrual period. Labor begins with contractions of the uterus, which help to gradually open the cervix and allow the baby to pass through the birth canal. Once the cervix is fully dilated, the baby is pushed out of the uterus and into the world. Postnatal care. After birth, both the mother and the newborn require postnatal care. The baby undergoes various assessments and screenings to ensure its health and well-being. The mother may need support with breastfeeding, recovery from childbirth, and adjusting to the demands of caring for a newborn. Throughout this remarkable journey, the mother's body undergoes profound changes to support the growth and development of the baby, demonstrating the incredible capacity the human body to nurture new life.